Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy, Capology Facts. It's all about the fucking bars. You bitch. Bitch, bitch, bitch. 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 What's good, man? So, I wanted to put out, I haven't did a um prediction blog in a minute okay i've been busy dealing with shit man life dealing with me being sick dealing with my kid being sick dealing with a lot of shit and also trying to do my radio show so i'm sorry i'm i'm going to get on it i'm getting on it man i'm on it bro I'm, I'm getting there man don't kill me Anyway, put out two blogs, my predictions. First one is BL5, man. The next one will be All Hail to the Queens. Going down this weekend. I got my dates confused. I thought it was last weekend, but no, it's this weekend. So, Born Legacy 5. I'm going to start off with F and O Red. Now, Born, Born Legacy 4, I predicted, I had O-Red, I want to say O-Red 3-0, but I'm not going to quite jump myself out the window yet, but I'm going to go ahead and give him a clear 2-1, okay? Only reason why I said, I'm going to make this short because I've already put out my prediction for them. So since the battle didn't go down because Av's sister passed away, salute to Av, man. I'm uh, I, I'm sorry to hear that you lost your sister, man. Um, keep your head up, bro. Be strong with your family. Make sure you have enough time to grieve, bro. Okay. So with that said, please. Expect. Oh, Red might not do it because his rounds is probably already done. But expect should to bring that shit up and don't get it twisted. Please don't fuck up the battle. Just saying. So, I feel like Oh Red is going to clearly show who the vet is and who has the better pen. I'm um, no knock to Av. Av is a good, um, he's a good battler. Heavy punches, fucking haymakers. The way he put those words together, man, salute to you, bro. With that said, clearly a disadvantage. So I got O Red 2 1. Now, I'm going to start off second with Jack Boy Maine and Ryder versus Dougie and Snake Eyes. Now, I, I've been caught on the radio shows saying I don't care about this battle. Only reason why I don't care is because I'm not really wanting to see a two on two. I see who's clearly favorites. And so since they didn't want to fuck up, URL didn't want to fuck nothing up, they're going to go give them a two on two and put them on Born Legacy 5. Since they already have New Jersey Twerk on Born Legacy 5. And clearly, Dougie beat New Jersey Twerk. And clearly, Ryder beat Trez. So. They have to put them on there. So they fucked y'all up and want to go ahead and play off this DMV versus New York, which that's just a whole little smoke. That's a motherfucking mist. That's a the smoke screen, nigga. That's kit. Kit. Smoke screen. The fuck?
You know, motherfuckers think I'm, uh, I'm just saying. I see fuck shit. I'm going to say that I see the fuck shit. If y'all don't see it, it's not my fault. It's not. Because I'm not making shit up. Okay. So with that said. Dougie's nice, but he sounds like chess to me. All those we go hard niggas for real, for real sound the same. And I get tired of that shit. Snake Eyes, uh, Snake Eyes pretty dope. I personally, I like his last battle. He to me, he lost. Um, Jack Boy Main's dope. And Ryder's dope. But I don't like this whole DMV movement bullshit. I don't. Because there's only one movement. Okay? One movement. And that's the motherfucking Midwest movement. And none of you niggas can kill any of these Midwest niggas. None of you niggas. None of y'all. New York or DMV. So, am I going to say fuck y'all? But... We the real Midwest movement. Y'all ain't shit right now, bruh. Y'all trying to y'all trying to ride on our ride on our wave. No, you can't. We've never heard no DMV versus New York beef. The fuck out of here. Anyway, with that fucking said, I got Jack Boy Man and Ryder 2-1. Okay. The third battle I want to talk about is the Saga versus Tink the Demon. Now, just like the two on two, I was saying that I'm really not interested in this battle. I'm really tired of the whole God devil angle in battle rap you can do it only so many times and it just get worn off just like it's just like two on twos i can't do it like it this might be dope but i really i i'm really when it drops i'm not gonna rush and click on it to watch it i'm not i'm not gonna do that it's because there's other battles i want to see but I'll watch it and, you know, get my, you know, my take on it, my reaction on it. But for the most part, it just feels like this is about to be saga. Talking about God and how to live. And Tink talking that murderous devilish shit. Like how many times we got to play that same scenario over and over again? Don't make no sense. Another thing for me, I don't like. There are certain battlers that are not per se Christian rappers. But they are godly, but that don't mean they have to rap godly. A war really doesn't like the doesn't rap godly. He don't. He's just uh he don't have God but God bars. He don't. He don't got angel bars. He don't got halo bars. He don't got he don't do all that all in his battle all the time. It depends on the person. Okay. So There's only been a couple of battle rappers that I've liked and like their style. And they, by battle rap terms, are Christian rappers. But he don't, you know, I like a, a person that's real that will talk that Bible shit. Plus, OK, I could shoot. I could shoot you, too. Like, that don't mean nothing. You could say that guy said that don't kill. OK. So am I going to protect myself? Okay. Somebody come to my house, threaten me and my family. You think I'm just going to say, well, God told me not to do anything to you. So obviously he wants me, he wants me dead. So he had you come kill me. 
Nigga, a shotgun to your face. Nigga, I don't miss. That's why they call me Capone. Cap one. Because I only need one. Okay? So, it is what it is, bruh. So, with that said, I got to think about this one. Because Saga hasn't really been on his shit. And Tink really hasn't either. So the two is... Uh, Tink really needs this win. So does Saga really needs this win too. But Tink needs to win more than Saga. So I'll probably go ahead and give... Saga to one. I'm not excited. This is my not excited face. That's my non-excited face. Okay. Next battle. Chef Trez versus JC. Block on block crime. Well, they're not with Riders Block no more, but they used to be. So, I don't know if Riders Block is still up and going. But, it is what it is. And what we've seen from Riders Block in previous battles, they've been dope. Dope. Dope battles. There's not one fucking battle you can sit there and say that it wasn't dope. Because all of them were dope, bro. All of them. All of them motherfuckers were dope. So with that said, man. I put out a blog. Talking about the URL. Disrespecting the Midwest. I said JC is top tier. And I feel JC, I feel Chef Cherez is, isn't worthy to battle JC. They should have gave JC somebody else. Somebody with a bigger name. Don't he deserve somebody with a bigger name? Why does he have to take somebody that's his status or below all the time? All the time. He don't get to take the bigger names. Why not? His pen is solidified. Nobody can knock JC because you know he comes with three fucking rounds of fire. I ain't going to spend that much time on this shit because Midwest is the best. Okay. Trying to work on my temper. Trying to work on the, all that yelling. I don't need to be doing all that, man. So. I got JC 30 in. No, I'm not going to do that. I do want to do that. I want to give him 30. Give him 30 and he's going to clearly beat this nigga. But I'm going to go ahead and take a 2-1 JC. Next battle is New Jersey Twerk, the Choke God, versus another Midwest battler that's not getting his respect. Clean motherfucking paper. Y'all niggas put clean paper against New Jersey Twerk? Why? You want New Jersey, you pushing the New Jersey twerk dude, right? You pushing them, right? You think New Jersey twerk is going to stop clean paper for advancing on the URL. That's what y'all hoping. But y'all made the dumbest mistake ever in life. Putting this choker against clean paper. Now, 
People are gonna come say, oh, Clean hasn't did this. He been cut off on the bag. He gonna do this. Okay, but that Clean, the Clean that face B Magic, the Clean that face Dick Tay Rock, that that Clean, he's coming. You gonna smack that dumbass nigga New Jersey truck? The Clean that battle Arsenal. Y'all fucking crazy? Nigga, clean 2-1. Fuck y'all niggas, man. We're the motherfucking Midwest. Who else is there? Is that it, man? What the fuck that's the battle? Oh, oh Red Ave. The 2-on-2. Two two. Jesus first the devil twerk versus clean JC versus chef Trez there's somebody else I think there's like one more. Is there one more? I don't know, man. I forget. Like, I thought I had all the battles. Old Red JC. The two on two. No, Old Red JC. Old Red and Av. The two on two with New Jersey. With, uh,. Snake Eyes, Dougie, Jack Boy Maine, and Ryder. Then you have New Jersey Twerk and Clean. And you have JC and Chef Trez. Then you have Saga and Tink. I think that's it, man. Don't shoot me if I forgot one battle. I think that's it, though. So, with that said, man, it's your boy, Capology Facts, man. It's all about the bars. Tune in to my radio show on Fridays and Sundays. 7 o'clock p.m. to 10 o'clock p.m. Central time go to blog talk radio capology facts hold this l radio subscribe to this channel like comment share follow the movement man i'm grinding right now shout out to the connects tv for putting your boy on if y'all know who connects tv is Type in YouTube, go to YouTube, go to Connects TV, and it's a Kansas City Battle League. And they put it on great battles, man. Check them out. The description be down below, man, from my page, from my, uh, from my radio show to... The Connects YouTube page, all that man. It's gonna be down below. My my uh, social media accounts will be down below. Man, follow your boy. This is Capology Facts, man. I only speak about bars, man. This battle rap shit is all about bars. Nothing else. <laughs>